Well, you know, I wasn't lying to you when I said people should spray their masks with colloidal silver. And uh, when Fauci came out and tried to downplay all the antivirals by saying, well, we know these work against some viruses, but you're going to have to prove it works against this virus before we're going to even let you even experiment with it, no matter how much of a threat your life is in. And these people who talk out both sides of their mouth need to have their mouths sewn together. That will keep this from happening. Oh, we're so scared for you. You have to quarantine. We're so scared for you. You have to wear a mask. We're so scared for you. We're pushing through vaccines at a record pace. And we really are going to have a huge, very large control group to study side effects. Yeah, but it's just because we're so worried about you. We're so worried about you, we have to destroy your jobs. We're so worried about you, we have to destroy your way of life. We have to destroy your constitution because we're so worried about you. But yet, we're not so worried about you that, that when there's strong circumstantial evidence that something could help you and there's no evidence that it can hurt you, then, well, we have to respect the scientific process. The scientific process, you can shove it up your nose, Dr. Fauci. Because now there is a true blue COVID-19 versus silver study that has come out. They sprayed a silver silica colloid. Um, and and we, we use a silver silica colloid, highly alkaline, by the way. Um, we use that for uh, to increase people's alkalinity with that have cancer. It's uh, called Alka V6, and that place is shut down because of COVID. Uh, thank you very much, Dr. Fauci. Uh, people needed that, that Alka V6. It was originally uh, produced and experimented on by Texas State University. So this isn't no slouch that's talking about Alka V6. But this is now another type of silver silica colloid. I don't know whether it's Alka V6 specifically, but they sprayed it on a mask and found that it had tremendous ability to deactivate all viruses that came in contact with that mask. And this is not just a coronavirus SARS. This is coronavirus SARS-2. This is the devil. This is the guy that we are trying to combat with billion dollar vaccine program. Meanwhile, suppressing anything that could save your life. Does that scare you that your government does that? <laughs> but yeah, well, we have to make sure it's safe. But in no uncertain terms, there is no way taking a silver product by mouth as long as it's pure and made in accordance with the, you know the standard supplemental um, you know conditions sterile conditions uh, no contaminants those kind of things then no way in hell is taking a colloidal silver supplement or a 300 milligram chloroquine tablet going to be more dangerous than an active coronavirus infection? No way! And part of the scientific process in medicine is risk versus reward. And in the coronavirus, if you're sick and you have symptoms, your risk is high. So even a minimal effect would be welcome because right now there is zero there is nothing you know how you can't get any lower than nothing being recommended or supplied to us by those who are so scared for our lives but here it is an anti-coronavirus SARS-2 test that proves that what we told you three months ago is absolutely true. Now, how did, how did we know three months ahead of a study that came out? How did we know that we were going to be right and that anybody who followed our instructions would be safer? How did we know? It's because we've done that research already. We've done that research years ago when studying silver 
and its effect against cancer. And remember, some cancers are caused by viruses. Remember papilloma? So, so there you go. And the other argument against, of course, anti-coronavirus medicine, the other argument is this. Well, we know, we know chloroquine attacks other coronaviruses, but you just can't prove it attacks this coronavirus. But we look at the mechanism of action. The mechanism of action is it targets a spike protein. And if that spike protein in the other coronavirus, and if that spike protein in HIV, and if that spike protein is identical to COVID-19, it doesn't matter what COVID-19 looks like, smells like, tastes like, and acts like. It has the same exact spike protein that has been targeted by these substances. Oh, jeez. So that is a that isn't evidence. That is overwhelming proof that these things have an anti-COVID mechanism. How? What? We know specifically. It attacks the spike protein. Period. And if you want to know how it attacks the spike protein, well, easy. We'll, we'll explain that to you, Dr. Fauci. Here, I know you get this because you tested it against SARS in 2005. Remember the SARS that has the exact same protein sequencing in the spike protein, the same exact electropositive charge. Yes, Dr. Fauci. So, so in essence, if you don't think uh, something sinister is going on with this coronavirus, if you don't think there's a sinister application at work, if you don't think that uh, there's a ulterior motive to all of this, uh, you just need to step back and look on how they're blocking a known antiviral from being used. How they're harassing people who are advertising, this could help you. This might help you. Now, when it comes to cancer stuff, and people are like, try this for cancer, and we know it doesn't work. And we try that for cancer. And we, we don't see the same heavy-handed, oh, incredible attention paid to shutting those people down. Why? Because that stuff doesn't work. They only care if it does work. Because when it does work, it threatens billion-dollar corporations that run the country and control our politicians. This should scare the living daylights out of you. It should. But here's the research Here's the link to the anti-SARS-CoV-2 using silver silica matrix sprayed on a surgical mask. You could apply this, they're talking about applying this to air filters, which is what we told you to do three months ago. Imagine how much better off the world would have been if they just listened to the Higher Truth Rises channel. We're trying to save lives. Please subscribe to us on Patreon. You can email us at any time through that system and you will get an answer. Please look and patronize our sponsor, Kimber Touch Technologies, KimberTouch.com. Until next time, eyes open.